What's up everybody? As you can see it here, I'm sitting behind my drum set and the reason is I have mounted my new pedal into the drum set and on the bass drum. But before I mounted the pedal on the bass drum, I changed some parameters and what I did, I will show you that right now. The first thing I did already is to change the position of the Cobra coil and also I changed the spring tension. What I want to do now is to change this beater position. So that means I have to hold the drive shaft like that, open that, screw up and so this is way too much. I need to open it up again. It's still way too much, so I open up that again and Let's see, this is still too much. So it's a bit of work. And now we have the same beater position. So I have my hand here and what really annoys me is when I play it like this you can see that the chain does some really weird things like that but i don't know if this is okay but i will try it out with my feet and see what happens so as we can hear it here. Ah, the problem is da gone, but we can still hear that the chain jumps a bit, but I don't know if this is good or not. And I will try my best to get it away but the machine feels really good right now but let's see what I also can change now I want to change the pedal height and for this reason I have here the main pedal of my old bass drum pedal because I want to have the same pedal height from my new pedal and the right side is really good but now I change over to the left side and see what I can do there. So I don't know if you see this but the left side on my new pedal is a bit higher than that of the main pedal so I will change that a bit so the left pedal has the same height as this pedal but I need to change again the beater position I also have changed now the spring tension on both sides I have now the same beater position and I will show you this. So the beaters have mostly the same frequency when they go forwards and backwards, forwards, backwards, forwards. So. As you can see it, the pedal is back on my drum set and 
what I have noticed right off the bat and what is now less annoying is that the chain is jumping. So I will play, I try to play my pedal right now. So, so I hope you can see this. So the chain is still jumping, but when I play that regularly, I don't notice that at all. So it is only a bit annoying, but it is an issue. But when I use this pedal, it is okay. I don't notice it at all. And the first playing feeling is good. So I have changed the parameters of the pedal. I have mounted it back on my drum set. And when you like this video, then please leave a comment, subscribe to my channel, like my videos and watch my videos. And as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for liking. Thanks for your comments. And we see us in the next video.